Welcome to Equistech's setup video for RS Links DF1 driver for the DL3500 unit. Start RS Links. Click on the Configure Drivers icon. It will come up with a Configure Drivers window. To select the DF1 driver, click on the little arrow to show the available drivers. Select RS232 DF1 devices. Click on Add New. A small window shows. Enter the name you want for your driver. This will bring up the Configure RS-232 DF1 Devices window. Here you select the communication port that is connected to the DL3500 when you click on the arrow beside where it says COM port. Under Device, when you click on the arrow, you can select 1770-KF2. Select the serial baud rate, station number in octal, parity, error checking, number of stop bits, and the protocol type. Those settings have to be the same as those that you set on the DL3500 when it was configured. Click on Auto Configure. It should come up with Auto Configuration Successful. Or after selecting the serial port, just click on Auto Configure. It will find the right settings as you can see here and come up with the Auto Configuration Successful. Click on OK. Click on Close. Now if you click on the RS Who icon and highlight the DF1 driver you set, you should see all the DH Plus nodes on the network which the DL3500 is connected to. This procedure completes setting the RS Lynx DF1 driver.